Hey guys, what is going on? This is LarkNuck1, and welcome back to episode 13 of my Let's Play of Civilization Beyond Earth. We are playing as the African Union, and we are going for a purity victory. Last time, we signed that all-important peace agreement with uh, the PAC here. They have not yet done any forward cities on us, which is very good, because that's what we want to avoid um, during those peace terms. Um, the peace has allowed us to speed up our game just a little bit, uh, and also focus on... You know, not so much trying to keep our guys alive while they have superior battle suits available, which is very scary, uh, but rather, you know, get academies up, focus on our kind of long-term science plan here. Because we are lagging a bit behind where I'd like to be at this point in the game in science, but purity always has science issues, so, you know, it's all relative. All right, so we have our worker here. What to do with this guy? Um, I am not opposed to sending him over here to this grassland and building a farm but maybe we want another academy right down here um i think that's what we do want so let's go ahead and do that All right, this one will be building us an academy as well and one trade convoy in bongani done where to send it we actually we can actually just like throw resources at whatever we send it to um so let's go ahead and throw those at magan magan deserves all the growth it can get and we've hit 12 people in magan very good so we're getting one more health from our virtue By the way, that reminds me. Let's look at our virtues. So we do have both of these health virtues. Uh, we'll go down to Magnusanti eventually, but I really want to get that 10% science. Alright, covert agents, what did they do? Alright, let's go ahead and siphon. Pretty sure they just established the network successfully. That's what they did. Okay. Alrighty, so now we have the quest decision... Um, all from the Xenofuel plant, finally. Alright, this guy is amazing. Um, you can either choose for a thousand energy, I'm not sure why you would, or you could go for a Harvest Xenomass, which gives you an obscene amount of production energy on all your Xenomass wells. That is what I'm doing. Yes, please, thank you, ma'am. Sign me up. That's just really good. These Xenomass wells are crazy now. Crazy levels of good. Look at that. Three food, two production, four energy, one science. Lock that in immediately. And these farms aren't bad. Let's go ahead and lock them in. In four turns when we finish the vivarium, uh, these food, to, these farms will actually be pretty good. Three food farms, not bad. Let's get this guy down here and build us an academy. This worker here, what to do with him? Let's send him up north. He can start building roads towards Xerxes. This worker is done here. Um, we can probably build... Yeah, on these tubers. Uh, once we get the Vivarium, this will be a four-food tile. Very good. And on this plane here, go ahead and build an academy. We should have our last worker in, in a yawn soon. Meanwhile, we do have to watch the population of Tabo and Ayan because when they hit 10, respectively, um, they will each be able to afford yet another trade route. Looks like the PC are doing something with a colonist. Alright, let's move the military in in case we have to DOW them. Why did I think I could trust the PAC for even 10 seconds? Alright, our worker here. Let's go ahead and move him. We could improve the Reslin or get a hill up. Let's get a mine on that hill. And we have our cloning plant quest, which is pretty cool. It's the choice between 10% food carryover from city growth and one health. Um, this is actually an important choice. Then again, it only occurs in all of our cities with Xenomass, because those are the only places where you can really build the cloning plant. Um, is it all cities? So this is just having them. Or you get one health. Uh, I'm gonna go with the food carryover. It kind of goes with the rest of the insane purity like buffs that we have going for us. And let's get this last worker up here to improve that grassland. I'm gonna ignore shooting the aliens. I don't really mind their presence all that much. And what to build here? Probably some marines, actually. When we do hit affinity, uh, what do you call it, six, which is kind of inevitable. Um, 
all of our troops, all of our marines at least, are going to be insanely strong. So, let's go ahead and do that. Or we can get artillery. Artillery is very good. Um, yeah, we might want to make a push on Tiangong once we do get the artillery. It's not a horrible idea. Oh, they already have sentinels. P what other PAC? Affinity 6 already. Ah, uh, this isn't good. Yeah, this is not good. Um, so let's go ahead and for sure get more marines up. Worker here is done. Let's move him across the river and give us another farm. Meanwhile here we can build the plantation. And our worker here can move up to build some roads. What to do with him? That's right, second academy. No. We're actually good with Elodie. Well, we're not friends, per se, but... Le commerce fonctionne quand no, on I'm, not, I'm not seeing how that benefits us that much. I'm glad we have these academies, but... Yep, they're going for a deploy. So what is the peace timer on Dowing them? Five more turns, it looks like. Uh, that said, like... PAC army is scary, like not not friendly. Um, very scary. Let's definitely get all of our tech jets up there. Go tech jets, go! And this guy, um, get him in position in case we do decide to DOW. Wanle is kind of in the middle of things. This is where I was going to build a mag rail, and possibly put another city. Um, maybe not. We're running into a lot of unhealth issues, and we did not focus for Magna Santi. Uh, instead, we we're going for that 10% science on our next virtue. It's going to be very good. So, what to do? Well, Tabo's going good. Jan's going fine. Growth-wise, we're good. I think we just need more Marines for when they do inevitably become Sentinels. Um, the Thorium Reactor in Tabo is done. Let's go ahead and grab ourselves a Gene Garden. Very good for energy as well, and it'll get our health up just that much. Uh, Xerxes is done. So, time to build the Trade Depot. And, you know, we're going to go ahead and speed this guy up by buying the Recycler early. It's going to help the production of the Trade Depot immensely. Construct this mine. Get a Raptor Bug in place. And we wanted to build a farm here, that's right. Definitely build that road. And you build us a farm. Build us the farm of our dreams. What? Oh, is Xerxes finished? Alright, we'll apologize to them, but not the PAC if they come howling. Not the PAC. Well, she just declared war on Elodie. I hope she moves her troops north. That's because, damn, we'll be able to hit her from the back. We still don't have Affinity 6, which we need to have. It's going to be very, very important. Uh, we need more Marines for that inevitability. Definitely have all our guys on standby and all of our attack jets in intercept mode. Um, we could ally her. She's making so much more science per turn than us. But nah. I mean, she does want to pass through the territory, but nah. You know? Nah. It surprised me how well the PAC has done, despite the fact that we've continuously tried to shut them down. Just how big their cities got and how defensive they were, as early as they were, it's just been horrifying. We need to keep making marines. And down here we finished the vivarium, very good. Uh, so now it's time to build a clinic, get our two health from it. And get us a little more stabilized on the health front. Okay, get our marine up north. And get these guys fortified in case war with the PAC happens. Which it probably will. 
Yep, if they're making a move on that city, then we need to war them. Yep, they took it. Just like that. And they have guardians now. If you listen at night, you can sometimes hear Casey Jones, the Wabash Cannonball, with his iron legs still running a mile a minute. Okay. Well, we now have access to the Bionics Lab, so that'll actually help Ayan grow quite a bit. Uh, they probably won't even need anything after that, and that'll improve their Resolent too, which Ayan has one, two, three, four of. Holy heck, give me that. Our science is still a little stifled. Um, let's go ahead and grab the Institutes. Actually, you know, I'll build another Marine here, and then in Magan, the capital, our next thing will be an Institute. So they have guardians now, which means that they now have they have eight purity. What the heck? They have eight purity. Eight. That's more than everyone else. Like, like bar none. These guys are at five. What the shit? That's crazy. That is crazy. All right. So, you know, we did get bionics. We're in place to grab a free nanotech as we need it, which we will. It's now time to go ahead and grab... You know, we could get LEV plants, not that we, that we could use them. Um, I think fabrication, and then... Jeez, fabrication, terraforming, and then civil support. Because if we can get the hollow matrix out and spam out those hollow matrices, um, that's going to help us a lot. A lot, a lot. We're going to be able to get all the culture we need to get down to Magna Santi. Which is certainly what, what needs to happen get our marines up there in case anything goes awry which it will it will oh my god they have lancers oh god they have lancers it's not good PACY PACY the only thing that's keeping us alive right now is the fact that we're at peace with the PAC it's a good time we did that when we did Good time when we did. What just arrived? Alright, alienist up there. I don't really care. Lil. Glory Seagull's gonna eat you! Bye! Oh my goodness. That army. Oh my god, Ken's is down. Next to no health. Well, we did get the points there. Not bad. Okay, da da da, all good. Yeah, I'm not gonna war them. Not without thinking very carefully about what I want to do with my life. <laughs> Alright, let's lock into academies, because for some reason the game is like, nah, we're not gonna work them. They're insane. They're really good. And get our marines up yonder. What is my life? Dude, Wanlei is going to be so fat if it becomes a city. Alright, we finished our clinic in Bongani. It's helping our health out just that little bit. And probably good to grab a lab. Those are very good for the science. Institute in Magan. Definitely a safe option. And this academy is done, so let's lock in. We aren't actually working that many production tiles in Magan because we're trying to grow so fast. Um, it's probably fine for now. I don't think our production's really that critical. After this next marine engine alley, we'll shift this thing over to science production. That's kind of what we need right now. And thankfully, Janali will hit 12, so we'll get one more health next turn. But one is not going to be that much. We need more. We need that Magna Santi. Definitely get our gunners a little back and bring the cavalry in. Not the cavalry, really, but you know. Oh boy. I sure do, do hope the PAC don't declare war on us, because it's the truth saving us at this point. Well, they can at this point. That's not good. Um, but, may happen. I don't see Juan Lei being something that we can actually attack unless they Dao us first. Um, at any rate, let's get our workers up there. I want to be able to build a Magrail up, up there as soon as I can. And our academy here is done as well. 
So let's go ahead and lock in. I have my priority straight. Thank you very much. Um, we could probably replace this generator with another one. Eh, we won't. Yeah, let's just go up north. This guy's done. Um, alrighty. Could we... We actually can't build more... Grasslands on desert, because they're actually already out. So let's go ahead and just build that on that fungus a plantation. Get this guy down south as well. I love how incomplete that academy looks. New! No, we like Hootimer. Hootimer is our BFF. For life. Dude, Hootimer is so chill. How could you not like him? How could you not like Hootimer? How dare ye? Jeez, we got so many marines up here. I dare you to come at me. <laughs> we got so many marines up here. Holy heck. Alright, last marine done here. Let's go ahead and do a research focus. You know, maybe science focus too. Yeah, there you go. There's 48 science. Not bad. Getting our science return up. As we need it to. Alright, Gene Garden done in Tabo. Looking very good here. Let's go ahead and grab the alien preserve. We'll need that culture. Ill done. Get on to that. What is it called? Resolin. Very important. Right, and just let's get our guys in position in case, you know, we do have to hit Wanlei. But, you know, honestly, as these current units are, it's unlikely that any kill will happen. Even if war breaks out. Um, as long as as long as the city's done, we're, we're screwed. So, let's work on the production of Ion. Uh, maybe get this last Resolin. Just because with the Bionics Lab done, these things are going to become actually really good. And get our get workers up north help out the fledgling colony and to go ahead and build mag rails as soon as they can. So it looks like we're probably doing our last uh, kind of round with the workers before they, they're going to have to start building mag rails. Um, Alright, what is that? That's nothing. Send this guy up north too. And last academy done. Lock that guy in. And send our worker back to the capital. You know, this guy back to the capital too. We do need to also build bag rails out from the capital towards close locations, um, just because that is important to getting the production bonus sooner. New no, sir. There goes the time. All right, we got time. We're good. All right, academy done down here. Let's go ahead and lock into that guy too. Which is really bring our production down in Magan, but you know what? Oh well, science matters. And the aliens are aggroed, even though we haven't done anything to them. Wonderful. Let's get that guy there. And the marine. Eh, you know what? Let's station him in the center. We have a lot of marines up there, like, a lot. I think we're okay for now. I think that we will be just dandy for now. For now. Wanlei is instantly a city uh, at 25 combat strength. You know, it's... We could not... We couldn't feasibly really kill it in one hit. Um, if the gunner's here. I mean, if our tack jets became... Needle jets, maybe. So let's go ahead and station our guys in Bungani just in case we need to do that airstrike. In case it becomes an inevitability. Alright, one academy done. Make sure Ayan is focusing it. And let's get this guy. Uh, where do we want him? Let's get him out by these planes to go ahead and build us another academy. Alright, this guy's all done. Good for you. Let's just station you right by Magan for when fabrication hits. Alright, Xerxes is out of its trade depot, which means it is. it now has two production buildings. Very good. Uh, let's grab the vivarium because growth is important. And so is that paddock. 
All right, you are dandy. Actually, we already have three workers up here. We're probably fine. Um, this guy can probably just stay around right here and put him to sleep for three turns. Meanwhile, he can go all the way up there, build us a magra in that direction once we can, and get a farm right here, right now. Right here, right now! Needle jet. So they finally made peace. And Kavitha finished the Promethean. Okay. Alright, well none of this looks too good. Tiangong is now a 20 population city. Like, like how AI? How? How are you cheating that well? I don't get it. <sighs> well, some things you'll never understand. Or do you want to drive the Magrail first? Probably out towards Janali. A little bit of everywhere is fine too. Um, so let's put our workers generally to sleep until that happens. Uh, that looks good to me. And this guy can work on this paddock. With the bionics lab done, it's going to be a really nice place to be. Um, this worker just finished his academy. So let's get him down here to build another 1-2 academies on these plain rivers. Okay, attack jets all good. I like where they are. And this marine can be stationed right here. I'm just hoping we can avoid a declaration of war at this point with the, with the PAC. Send this guy to sleep. To sleep. And you need to build a road, sir. As do you. I wonder if they'll finish their roads before the fabrication comes out. And if so, what happens? I actually don't know. The PAC are expanding their territory. Um, this is no good. This is very bad, in fact. They are not sitting on the top of the scoreboard, though. Kavitha is. She has seven harmony now. Not looking too good. Um, so now the question is, Techno Artisans or Learning Centers? Um, let's do a head count on the academies we have. One, two, three, four, five. All right. Six, seven, and this would be eight, nine. Um, that is nine academies. So this guy here would give us nine science. Uh, whereas this guy gives us 15% of our culture, which is 54, uh, so that's, you know, more or less 7. So you know what? It's actually better to get learning centers. So let's go ahead and do that. And just like that, our science will be a lot higher. Lab done in Bongani. Um, what to do now? We already have the clinic here. Very good. I think it's probably good to grab the auto plant earlier because you just get solid production heading forward and get all of our guys nice and fortified. Oh boy, oh boy. Let's grab the academy. Are these... Is Ion focusing both of these? Not the second one. But it needs to be. Well, our energy is now dipping negatively, so this is bad. Um, What's ours is yours. We might want to think about price. selling some of our assets out to a friendly neighbor like the Polystralians. We can't really risk our energy per turn getting too low as we start to build mag rails because they are going to be a expensive. Heuristic for determining metacognition. So let's definitely try that. Um, okay, where are you, Hudimer? Good to see you again. Choo, 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 choo. Um, we could probably sell them all our so Xenomass. What's ours is yours. Let's see. For a oh, he's going negative. He can't. Well, well then, sir. Well, we could sell to the highest bidder. Um, Kavitha, I'm not opposed. No, she'd probably love it. Namaste. What would you pay us for this? Speak from your soul. Lots of stuff. Lots of random stuff. Ek or ek hote Let's see. Um. For five, would you be willing to do ten? Weird offer, weird counter offer. Uh, she wants the titanium. Well, we're not going to do that in case we need some titanium satellites. Um, so how about just a solid ten? How's that? Okay, how about nine? Okay, how about eight? Well, the time is up, and Mrs. Kavitha here is being completely just like 
hard to please. Seven's my last offer. All right, there we go. As you will. But thank you guys for watching, and until next time, what is going to happen of our great civilization here? Are we going to be able to come back from just like where we are in the scoreboard right now? Uh, these mega giants right here are going to be hard to compete with. These two in particular. Elodie, she's at the top of the scoreboard, and I really don't know why. Uh, she's not doing too hot affinity-wise, but we'll see. Until next time, guys, take care.